a warm welcome once again. Uh, to my person, my name is Marisa Duch. I've been working for Horizon since uh, 14 years. Um, I'm a passionate book binder, so I love books, and I love what I do in the end. So um, to give you a first impression of where we are at the moment, in the middle, in the center of a showroom, I think you came here a little bit earlier. You can see a lot of systems which are, weren't running until now, so we are now starting our highlight tour. Um, to give you an idea, we are in our showroom, so our showroom is divided in our certain areas which we are um, yeah, presenting our systems. So this is um, collating and stitching. We have binding and cutting, which is located in the left-hand area. And we have, of course, a very important product of ours, which is folding and creasing. And die cutting as well as laminating. We also would like to yeah, introduce our new or let's say upgradable versions of IceLink. So behind you there's our let's say workflow zone where we present um, yeah, a workflow solution together with Impress where we let's say simulate a workflow from a PDF up to uh, and sending a JDF to our upstream device, which is our smart stacker. So the IceLink was available in the uh, IoT basic version. So which allows you to um, monitor the status of the machine, uh, do KPI analysis starting from the bottom. Um, and preventative maintenance was also a very um, yeah, important part about IoT basic. Um, with the uh, upgradable second version, which is automation, we can um, provide a JDF and JMF workflow, as well as a web API uh, communication to upstream devices. Um, with the enterprise, um, you can create jobs, edit jobs, delete jobs, or schedule jobs on your system. Um, if you would like to know more, of course, of IceLink, please head over to our software um, island, and we have some specialists then presenting the system. Um, then we have some smart, um, let's say, finishing solutions in our showroom as well. So you can see, or you saw when you came in, which uh, was our smart stacker, which is a B2, um, um, let's say, machine which um, cuts, collects, and stacks sheets. So a basic application for this is, of course, um, calendars, uh, photo books, or greeting cards. Um, and all this process in B2 digital sequently printed um, sheets. Yeah, but our smart finishing so solutions is, of course, as well, our smart binding system, where we have a combination of our smart folder as well. So this is a, um, the same machine where you can create variable um, books in thickness, but also in format and size. And then we have our smart stitching zone where we present our stitch liner Mark V, which is a booklet maker. So we're coming from the web and we're feeding um, the sheets directly into our newly designed um, stitch liner Mark V. So I will go to the machine. You can follow me if you want. What we have here is um, a Hankala unwinder and cutter. So we cut the web into single sheets and feed them into our um, um, stitch line on Mark V. Just give it a second until the machine starts running. So sheet by sheet is fed into our um, stitch liner. Each sheet is single, um, let's say, crease, so we can really um, ensure a high quality booklet. Then the sheets are, thank you, are transported in our unique transport system where we um, create an overlapping of each sheet. So this um, allows us to create a high, let's say, speed as well as quality. Over here, the um, brochures are being separated individually. So what we're doing here is we're running applications out of three with different page count. So it's a 12-page, 24-page, or... 16-page uh, brochure. Then after the booklet is stitched, we feed it directly into our trimmer, where, it's been, where, where we trim it on three sides. In this configuration here, we also have our PSX stacker, where we create stacks out of the booklet. Then we have a banding in the back, and also a collaborative robot, which is supporting us to pack the brochures on the delivery.
the Stitchliner Mark V can also be equipped with a cover feeder. So over here we have a cover feeder where you can um, insert a cover on the top or um, the same pages individually inside the booklet. booklet. So also it's possible that on the um, um, cover feeder you can feed six page um, covers. So in, for that, I don't know if you can see it, but the bin is, let's say, separated into two levels. So this allows us a really smooth and flat um, layer of the covers, so we have a really accurate feeding. The cover feeder can also be used um, as a digital feeding, so that means if you have sequently printed um, sheets, you can also load them on the cover feeder and um, produce brochures. <laughs> so with this robot solution, we would like to yeah, give you an idea of how these robots can support us in production. So when the box is full, I think that's the last package, hmm? is it? No? One more? Yeah. It's not full yet. So the, he's the operator, so all he has to do is basically, yeah, um, see that the machine is running, that the boxes are put on pallet, for instance. So. A very smart solution. So the, the developments on this um, Stitchliner Mark V, as I said, of course, before, is the uh, web-based uh, printing uh, digital inkjet technology. And then we make it over to our next system, which is our case binding system or case preparation binding system. So you just simply follow me. So here we also have a unwinder, a cutter, and a stacking device from our partner Techno. So what we created here, because we wanted to show a total inline solution, is that we're creating stacks. So this is a two-up application where two books are um, being delivered from the stacker um, towards our ESF um, end sheet feeder. Excuse me. So then we also have a. Um, um, robot, which is then taking the books and loading the books. It's a very simple task for the robot, but I don't have to do anything as an operator. So all I do is I, I run around the machine and look if everything is okay. So then book by book is being fed on the conveyor. It's going through our newly end sheet feeder HD1000, ESF, sorry, ESF1000. Then the books are leaving the end sheet feeder and are being transported to our LBF 500, which is our loose sheet book block feeder and our perfect binder BQ 500. So what we do is we transport the book, we stop the book, we measure the thickness, we set up the binder, and there goes the binding. So the end sheet feeder, the LBF, or the, the, the book block feeder, the LBF 500, is capable to run cut sheets, um, folded signatures or suit book blocks as well. So the books are being jogged in two stations. So at the moment we are running about 500 books per hour and you can see how the books are being jogged in the LBF and then fed into the binder. Then after the books are bound, um, they're leaving the binder, they're being stacked in up to two books, and then are cooled to our uh, three-side perimeter HP 300. So with this system, we're able to run soft cover as well as book blocks for the uh, hardcover production. So we can add a end sheet and of course a gaze on the book block. So we have stopped the uh, production now because I really would like to show you another solution in that system which is our palletizing robot, which we have developed together with Freise Automation. Basically, it's their product. Very clever guys um, with a, um, let's say, good solution. We trim the books on three sides. 
And then the uh, robot picks up or recognizes the book, stack recognizes the book and puts it on the pallet automatically. So you can see two pallets uh, at the robot, so that means if that pallet is of course full, the robot automatically starts to load on the uh, second pallet. I mean, I was a little bit explaining the system, but just to give an impression, I was the only operator on the system. So I have collaborating robots which are supporting my, supporting my work and all I have to do because of that automated workflow is to uh, secure that there's enough glue or covers at the machine. So this is what we say it's a smart finishing product. Um, in our showroom you can see at least 20 systems ready to demonstrate. So in a highlight tour of course we will not be able to show all the machines. But we have a new rotary die cutter, our RDN 4055, with a card stacker, which is in the right corner. And our new um, uh, B2 folder, the AF566 FKT. So feel free to ask all of my colleagues and specialists to give you a good presentation. If you have any questions regarding this system, um, I'm here to support you and to answer all your questions. Thank you.